Right, so we've converted uh, the input statements to scanf and now let's, uh, there's a need to declare the variables, so declaring these two variables. So, Alright, so now converting the while statement, the while statement converts, the while statement converts as it is, there's no need to do anything, just that you need to add a block for, the, for this. The same rules that we had in if else that the block should be enclosed within braces. Uh, there is any another statement input player two, so we'll have a scanf player two here, and the print statement translate to a printf statement, and that's it. We just need to add a few messages so that the user knows what input is, what uh, this prompt is about. So we just need to tell the user what input we actually require. So let's say to the player one that think of a number. And let's say, let's call this player one, think of a number. Let's, let's uh, similarly play, let's add a message player two guess the number and if the player 2 does not guess it correctly then we, sh we should uh, ask player to guess the number again or simply try again all right that's it now let's compile and run this let's see what happens guessing game v2 GCC guessing game view.c. Alright, no errors. Let's run this. Play over, think of a number. Obviously, this would be very uh, uninteresting because you know you can see the number, but still, let's just check. Alright, 3, try again. 4, try again. 8, try again. And 2, try again. 4, try again. 19, try again. And 10 get reward that's it uh, we can do what we discussed in the class that after the player one thinks of the number we can clear the screen uh, let's do that uh, for that we need to add a library in fact let's talk about the library later we need to clear after the player one and push the number we need to clear the screen so there is a function just like printf and scanf we have a function called system and within these double quotes we can add the command for example, the command to clear screen is CLS on Windows. So this is the command, this is the function call. Uh, so since every a function belong it belongs to a library, so the library for this function is stdlib, which uh, which is basically a short for standard library. So let's compile and run this. Let's compile it. Let's clear this screen first. Let's compile this and let's run this. Player one now thinks of a number. Now that number has been erased. Now player two can guess the number. Uh, let's assume that while player one is entering the number, player two is not looking at the screen. So in that case, this this looks fine. So all right. So try this out and see you guys later. Goodbye.